It is Taco Tuesday and my name is Luke Dancy. I am a magician and magic consultant living out here in Las Vegas. So if you are coming to Magic Live this summer, odds are you will see me around these parts. All right. So let us know in the chat if you are coming to Magic Live, uh, which happens every year in the summer. Nice hot summer here in Vegas. Uh, of course, we've got the free wheel tonight. If you want to join that, you want to win some free stuff, all you need to do is say win. Type in W-I-N in the comments and do just what Ryan Wallace did. And that means we will add Ryan and everyone else tonight that joins us for our free giveaways, okay? So that's gonna be good, good stuff. Brand new feature tonight too, friends. If you wanna know when we're live every week, if you're watching on Facebook anyway, type in exclamation point notify and it'll automatically hook you up and make it very easy for you to know when we are live, okay? So it's another little new thing that we're doing here along with the regular, some of our friends out there in the All Things Magic live chat room, which we like to call the lounge. Good to see our friends out there. Thanks for popping on and joining us for a little bit on a Taco Tuesday. Actually on a Tuesday, which is uh, which is awesome. I love it when things work out like that. All right, friends. So the first thing I'm going to tell you about is the thing that literally just popped up here in the All Things Magic warehouse. I had them rush this over to me. No shit. Uh, and it is the ultimate vanishing bottle from Henry Herius and Nielsen Magic. Now here's the deal, Nielsen Magic, you know, Norm Nielsen and Lupe, they were the makers of all of the original vanishing bottles. Uh, supply chain difficulties, they had trouble continuing to do that, but Henry Harry has cracked the code and Henry has now teamed up officially with Nielsen Magic to release these brand new babies for you. These are not available everywhere yet, but they're available here for you. And I am super stoked to tell you more about it. I'll probably do a review later this week, but right now, because uh, I just got here. But I'm going to have you take a look at the trailer, see a little bit more about what this is from Henry Harris himself. This is FBOM approved. Check it out. Yes. Hell yes. These are finally, finally here. And I am about to crack the box on these. Um, obviously, we have refilled from Henry, which is the Corona version of this. But I wanted to take a quick peek. I don't know how these are packaged. I don't really want to reveal anything. I also do want to say something. The audio convincer is always welcome uh, in any magic. I, uh, Henry does credit the fact that that is a Gaetan Bloom concept to add the audio um, kind of convincer for a vanishing bottle, which is cool. So yeah, uh, right away I must say, the other thing I do want to say is the, the noise gimmick that allows you to make the bottle sound like it's a real bottle is included with this. It is included with this. So that is a nice little bonus there um, for you. So I'm seeing the little gimmick for that is included in here along with the bottle. You have the opener, the bottle opener, which again will help add to that convincer. And you also receive the labels for the bottle itself. So you're going to get the labels. If you have refilled from Henry Harris, you know uh, pretty much what's going on. Differences again, they've redid the bottle to make it look like a very common vanishing, uh, not a vanishing bottle, but a Coke bottle that you would see in most stores, a glass bottle. Uh, and the other cool thing is too, um, they also included something from one of our friends out there. Uh, Brian Sanders, the tip that Brian gave on the All Things Magic group for refill, where you could actually pour liquid from the bottle, that's included with this new version, the Ultimate Vanishing Bottle. Uh, it is also included here for you. So that's what this is. And Henry actually posted in the group 
uh, not too long ago. I was going to show you that. Uh, a little closer look here at the vanishing bottle. Uh, again, with that nice convincer. I'm not going to play the sound here just because it's the Stranger Things theme. Um, but yeah, this is based on the Mexican Coke bottle. And it is actually better. The Coke is actually better than stuff we have here. So yeah, you can do it just like the, the refilled version with the Corona, um, where you actually cause the bottle to fill back up, uh, which is cool too. But you'll see here, uh, of course, oh, the bottle has vanished. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, it's really gone. But you can totally do the refilled version as well. But you do get that nice convincer of the sound at the beginning for this. So we are very stoked, very proud to have these in stock for you. They literally just arrived. Someone was asking about the refills on this. Uh, this comes with probably 15 or 20 of the labels for the bottle. You do not have to use a new label every time, but they give you enough to last for quite a while. And refills will be available just like they are for the refilled version with the uh, Corona bottles as well. So everything's here. This damn thing looks great. I plan on taking a closer look at this and I'll give you more details um, because they literally just got here in my hands. Also, we got something else very special from Henry Harris we'll be putting on the website very soon. Stay tuned for that. I'm not gonna tell you what it is just yet, but we also ordered something else. So all this stuff just came in from Hong Kong and we are very stoked to have this for you. So that is the ultimate vanishing bottle from Henry Arias. All right. So that is exciting, exciting news. And the cool thing too is, friends, if you end up buying the bottle in the States, if you're a U.S. customer, it's free shipping on top of that just for buying that. So there you go. All right. <laughs> uh, good stuff. So let's go ahead and jump into our first free giveaway of the night. And then we're going to do something fun tonight, a new little feature that we've never done before as well. And we're already 60% of our goal. If we hit our goal tonight, friends, there will be a flash sale for you, a five-minute time limit, five-minute window live on our show for you if we hit our goal. So help us do that by donating your stars. And uh, we are definitely getting closer. And thank you to Chris Cram and everyone else out there that is helping us. And there's another big giveaway on top of it, which is fun too. So anyway... Let's go ahead and jump to the big wheel and do our first free giveaway of the night. All right, friends, here we are. If you would like to join the big wheel, all you need to do is type three little letters, W-I-N, and that will get you added up right away. Uh, I've got a couple more names I'm adding real quick, like Ellis Cohn. Good to see you out there, Ellis. Hope you are doing well. Always a pleasure to see you out there, my friend. Uh, we have a lot of other friends out there as well, like The Wizard over on the YouTubes as well. So we're gonna do our first spin, kind of keep things moving, and then we'll add more names as we go on. So if you're not on the wheel just yet, hang tight. More giveaways are on your way. And also, we will add you as we go. So here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go. Cheers, everybody. All right, Taco Tuesday. Super damn stoked that these just came in. Super stoked. Been seeing these floating around since Blackpool, Blackpool Convention. I knew I had to have them. Fresh from Hong Kong to you. <laughs> Get yours now. And our first winner of the night is Rohal Masood. Rohal, I think I'm saying that right. Anyway, congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations to Rohal. You are going to pick up a free magic download, Rohal, uh, which is what we do every week for our free winners. So you need to do me a favor and send us an email, info at allthingsmagic.com, and we will get you hooked up with something that our team picks for you, Rohal. So be sure to hit us up. As always, friends, you have a week to claim your prizes around here, and if you don't claim your prize within that time, the prize is no more. It is no, no mas. It is no good. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. All right, friends, there we go. Congrats to our first winner of the night, Rohal Masood. And as I mentioned before, if you want to join our giveaways tonight, it is so easy and it is so free. Just say win in the comments like Mr. Joe Berman just did. And we will hook you up with a free entry into tonight's goodness. All right. And thank you, Jim Cox, for your stars. Good to see you out there. It's your boy, Jason R. Smith. He has arrived and we will add him to the wheel Thank you, my friend, for being out there. Good to see you last night for some Korean barbecue and some sushi and some cigars and just all kinds of goodness, my friend. Good times. Good times. Good to see you out there, Mr. Mike Miller. Always a pleasure, Mr. Miller. Hope you are having safe travels, tra travels out there. I know you were in Dallas 
seeing Dan Spirit the other night, which was really cool. All right, so uh, let us do a new feature. I'm excited to try something new around here. And we are breezing along 76% to our goal. Thank you, my friends, for your support, first of all. That goes without being said, but it needs to be said. So thank you for your support. We definitely appreciate it. And thank you, Mr. Jason, for your support there as well. I'll get you added up on our star support series. Uh, something new that I wanted to try with you is I'm slowly starting to enjoy TikTok. I know, who would have thought? If I can guess the last uh, one. And so what I thought it'd be fun to do is to take a look on TikTok to see if there's any live magicians. So we're gonna do that right now. Uh, I'm left. currently on TikTok and there are people, and I've typed in the word magician. We are in the live section and I am gonna look real quick to see if there are any live magicians that we could tune into to see what they're up to. Uh, this is my new vice, going through the old TikTok, old TikTok. Uh, not seeing any faces pop up. Actually, our buddy Sav was on here and about 30 minutes ago, Sav was on, and I thought it'd be fun to see him. I think I did see there was a guy named TK popping on. I don't know who this guy is. Let's see what he's up to. This is S. I don't think he's doing magic, though. Magic. No magic. No live magic right now. So we will have to look back at this uh, soon. I don't see any I don't see any magicians that are live right now. Let me type in uh, magic tricks, maybe. Let's see. Magic tricks. Uh, of course, we're not doing any reveals. We're not doing that. But let's a little see bit of a no energy because you don't here doing doing some stuff live right now. We got card tricks. Ooh, card tricks. Let's see what's going on with this guy. Right on top of the black cards. This is going to happen right in front of your eyes. Watch. Just like that. And they mix themselves. But I can show you. There's a red one. There's a black one. What are we doing? There's a red one. Oh, we're doing some oil water. There's a black one. There's a red one. There's a black one. There's a red one, and there is our last black one, the eight of spades, right there. You see, it's all you have to do to mix them. Sam the Magic Man. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Good stuff, Sam. All right. If you guys are on TikTok, be sure to let us know. We will check out your account. I know our friend Good Orlando stuff, Hernandez is on. Thanks, all things uh, magic. We had fun checking him out. Hey, anyone, you know anyone else right now that is hanging out yeah. doing any magic? Uh, seven, and Sam seven, just seven. followed us on the live. That's pretty cool. All right. So definitely enjoying a new a new place. Ten. These uh, magic tricks. We'll type in magician one more time just to take a peek, and then we will keep it moving for tonight's show. So uh, yeah, and we do have to be careful with the music too, don't we? Because you never know that could end up getting us flagged. So I'm I'll a keep a look free. out here to see if there are any magicians performing any of the magic. There was a lot of people on earlier. I'm surprised that there was no one on right now. So we will come back to that. We'll come back to TikTok here shortly. I think I'm also getting text messages. Let me take a quick peek here. Uh, mute your phone. Okay, I will do that. I will mute my phone while I'm scrolling. Okay, gotcha. Thank you for the heads up. <laughs> All right, friends. So Taco Tuesday, what do we do? Well, we just told you about our first magic trick of the night. We usually bring you like a top three list. Uh, we also bring you some magic news. And we also give you a chance to win some free stuff on our giveaway wheel. This is always exciting, right? And tonight, we are going to be doing a flash sale if we hit our goal, along with a big giveaway for one lucky viewer out there. So let's jump into some magic news um, before we actually do the giveaway stuff, more, more of the old giveaways. So one of the really cool things that just happened that I really, really wanted to go to, there was a magic convention in St. Louis, Missouri that a lot of our friends went to. Um, and unfortunately, I had some performing to do, some gigs and some other priorities, uh, TV meetings, and I couldn't go. But several of our friends went, including the tremendous um, Robbie Moreland. So this is Robbie lecturing at the convention known as the Gateway Magic Convention there in St. Louis. And you can see him in action doing some card work, some coin work, and just looking tremendous all over the place. So that's very cool to see our buddy Robbie out there. He was booked to perform and lecture, and I'm sure he did a killer job. Not only was he there, John Bannon was the guest of honor. This is a really cool look at him in action. A couple of nice shots here of John Bannon doing what he does. And thank you to Robbie Moreland for hosting those. That's really cool to see, a little look in at the convention. Also, some of our friends just went to hang out, like this guy, my old pal Randy Shirley, my very first mentor right there, the legendary Doug James. And of course, the legendary man himself, Scott R. Smith, was in the house. 
I'm not sure who our new friend is over there, but I'm sure he's fits right in with the other guys. So much love to all of these guys, including the new guy. Um, but I wish I could have been there. I'm hoping, hoping, hoping to see some of you, though, coming up here over the next few months. So it looks like you guys were having a blast. Not just these guys, but these guys, too. You can see there Mr. Michael Dawkins, who's usually hiding behind the scenes in our live chat room. Mr. Dawkins was there. Robbie again, standing next to him. And our old pal, Mr. Claude Wyatt, he was there as well, hanging out. And there were quite a nice crew of people there from the All Things Magic group. Um, so that was nice to see a good turnout over there at the uh, St. Louis, the Gateway Convention. So there you go. Yes. But Robbie rocked the place sexy, smooth, and silk, and so relaxed. He is really good. He is the real deal. So we'll bring you some footage as well from the Gateway Convention. Coming up soon, Robbie sent me a video clip of one of the performers there, uh, Steve Ehlers, and it is a great little clip, but I'm going to have to tease you on that for just a moment because it is time to keep the show moving and grooving here. And one of the other people that was there, one of our own as well, All Things Magic own, uh, David Parr. David was there, one of our old pals, and he was actually on the TV, he was on the news doing some magic, and we're going to show that as well coming up here in a few minutes. We've got that for you too, okay? So lots of good stuff tonight. Uh, so we already showed you trick number one of the night. Again, this is the ultimate vanishing bottle from Henry Harris. We now have them as of about 20 minutes ago. They just arrived from Hong Kong. That is exciting stuff for all of you. The next thing I want to show you is something that I absolutely love. I'm a big fan of organic stuff. If you know me, you know I love organic magic. And this next thing does that. And there is a beautiful, beautiful retention of vision with this, with the organic switch box from Julio Montoro. Yes, the Leviosa guy. He's got some other stuff for you too. This one is fun. Watch the visuals. This is something up close. This is not just the trailer. This is him, just a camera, giving you a better look at the organic switch box. Hello to my friends of Belgium. So basically, this is the organic switch box. You're going to receive this switching device to change, to switch this caught inside the tic tac box into this one which is designed by the spectator so basically this is the switch because you just have it pump here and doing this you are going to do the switch watch this has been the switch so now you show this and it is the spectator signs card. As you see, the switch is totally invisible and is self-working, meaning that you just need to worry about the presentation. So this is the organic switch box. All right, friends, welcome back. That is the organic switch box from Julio Montoro. And I think now you can see why I like this so much. And here's another closer look. Uh, at the switch happening and again that retention of vision is just something to look at here he is kind of giving you a little peek uh you have the, the sign card let's say you've done an ambitious card routine or something else and at some point you reach down and you point your tic tac uh, box and then you take the lid off and right there it just happened again uh, the card that was in there's now switch for their sign card and it is beautiful stuff you know what else is beautiful actually uh the wifey during the little video of julio there brought me the official taco tuesday Tacos. So I am having tacos with you tonight, friends, um, as we are enjoying another weekly live stream with you. So I'll be digging in here uh, in just a couple minutes. Uh, Scott R. Smith, uh, Luke, where is the book for the Ultimate Warrant deck? I have the deck, but I need the book you brag so much about. Uh, I believe the book is in stock. I'll have to take a look, uh, Mr. Scott. But if it's not, we, we have more coming. Um, but yes, that, that is something that is available for our friends out there, the Ultimate Warrant deck book. Uh, so a couple of key points about this, about the organic switch box. Yes, the gimmick comes pre-made, which to me is like the best part ever because I don't like making stuff. So that is good. David First also says, some magicians need Tic Tacs. So I'll, let, so I'll let them talk about that. Um, but it does come pre-made, which is great. Um, I'm a big fan of not having to do-it-yourself stuff because that's just no fun. Uh, the other nice thing is the reset for this is a very quick reset. So if you're kind of doing table hopping, walk around type of stuff, you are good to go with this as well. So that is nice to know. You don't have to worry about going in a corner for like an hour and fixing it. It'll fix itself very, very quickly. So that is good too. And it's just a perfect everyday carry. You pop it in your pocket with your stuff. It doesn't look like a magic prop. And that for me is the best part ever. You're going to see him now 
reaching over and grabbing the TikTok, TikTok, Tic Tac box. And he is now going to perform the switch right about here, right about here. You're gonna see it coming up. And the switch just happened. And now that is the signed card. So any angles before the lid is taken off. Uh, I think, you know, pretty much you want to do this close to your body, anyone kind of behind you. It's not, not exactly going to look so good. So anyone kind of like in this area here, like a half circle, you are good to go. If there are people around you, just keep it close to you when you do it and you will be fine. Um, but angles are very friendly with this one for sure. Uh, Ryan Garber called me out on that one. The TikTok tack box. I know. <laughs> TikTok tack box. So there we go, friends. That's brand new. It's called the Organic Switch Box, and it is from Julio Montoro, a very creative guy around these parts. And we have that one for you. The link was in the chat. So uh, have a look at that one if you are interested. That's the Organic Switch Box. And we are 86% of the way to our goal tonight, which is awesome sauce. And yes, that one did look great, right? Did look good. Uh, appreciate that. Um, thank you, the wizard, for the love. You know, sometimes in life, it's just time to move on and to do your own thing. And that's exactly what I'm doing here. And it's good to have you with us, the wizard. So be sure to join us. We are live right here every single Tuesday night at 8.30 Eastern time uh, with what you see. Giveaways, magic tricks, news, friends. We have friends galore here every week in the live chat room that we have. So we would love to have you join us again. All of you, if you're new out there too, if you're watching over on uh, Facebook, a brand new feature to type in exclamation point notify and that will actually let you know when we're live which is a pretty neat feature so that's only for facebook at the moment i know we're kind of branching out we're working on that uh so yeah uh, ryan wallace luke are you going to make a uh profile for oops uh, atm on the old tiktok we have one already and we're going to start posting more uh regularly over there i've been just kind of enjoying being an observer for right now ryan but we will be and actually, if you guys would like to give us a follow on the old TikTok right now, that is very, very easy to do. I'm going to bring this up for you. I'll bring up our profile and show you how you can keep up with this over there. Now, of course, we're, uh, you know, we're, we're growing. We're, we're just starting the account, literally. But that's our account right there, All Things Magic Official. So if you guys would like to keep up with us over there, that is the place to do it. All Things Magic Official on the old TikTok. So yes, Ryan, we are there. And we have Danny out there. Much love from Vegas. I'm in Vegas too. So good to see you out there, Mr. Danny. All right. Uh, 90 Day Fiance, favorite tricks of 2024 so far. Uh, a couple of my favorites that I've been using a lot. One of them is the perception trick from Richard Griffin. That is a trick that I did a review of recently. Talked a lot about because I just love how straightforward it is. And it feels so impromptu. You're borrowing these objects. You make a prediction put the prediction down, they reach, grab one of the objects, and you turn over your prediction and it matches what they picked every single time. That's been one of my top picks, honestly. And I know that that's not one of the more mainstream tricks, but I gotta tell you, it is damn good. It's really damn good. Uh, this is something I was waiting on too, uh, the Ultimate Vanishing Bottle. That's another, it's gonna be in our, our list of top things for sure as well for this year. And uh, I'm trying to think if there's any other things. Oh, something else is actually one of my top picks this year. Because I love coin magic. A lot of people don't know that. But one of my favorite pieces that came out was out of stock for a long time. We finally got these back in stock too, friends. We've been waiting. The Morgan coin sets. These are replicas, but they look and they sound just like the real thing. You get the coins, the replicas, and you get the turtle as well. You see the coverage there. Uh, this is another favorite this year. Honestly, for the... Best bang for your buck, in my opinion, when it comes to a coin set. This is hard to beat, truthfully. Uh, and if you want to grab that and a jumbo, uh, a jumbo Morgan, you can actually save 10% if you buy the set and the Morgan that matches the, the jumbo one. We also have that for you. So that's, that's another thing I've enjoyed. I'll be putting together more of an official top 10 list because we are getting close to the halfway point of the year. So, yes. Uh, all right. Uh, SpongeBob. Hey, Luke, I live in an Arabic country and I want to participate at FISM and I don't know anything about where and how can you, you tell me? Well, what I would recommend, SpongeBob, is to go over to the FISM website. I know that here in the States, they're going to have the FISM qualifiers at the TAOM convention, which is a combo of TAOM and the SAM, Society of American Magicians, coming up this summer. 
That's just for the United States, though. That's the qualifiers to see who could get into the, you know, to represent the United States at FISM. When it comes to you being uh, from an Arabic country, I'm not exactly sure where the qualifiers are for you. So you might want to go again over to the FISM website and have a look there. And any of our friends in the chat that may know about that, please, please feel free to share that as well. Uh, let me see if I can find the address for you. It's very easy to get to. Uh, so we're going to put this in the chat here. Uh, FISM.org is the link to check it out for FISM. Our buddy Mike Miller is actually helping to book the talent for the convention I just mentioned, the TAOM and SAM convention. Um, so yes, yeah, so I would have a look there. Might be some details about how to do that, but being here in the States, I don't know exactly what to tell you. Good to see you out there, Yitz. It's been a minute. Hope you have been doing well, Mr. Yitz. We will get you added to our free giveaways uh, right about now. So let me do that real quick. We'll just add you as Yitz. That is good. Uh, all things magic releasing their own products in 2024. We are. Um, it's been something that kind of building up the library of stuff, and then we're going to start to film it. And we're going to be doing some of that this summer, and we are going to be doing that beyond. So, yes, we will be releasing some all things magic products as the year continues to go on. So, yeah. Uh, Mike Miller says if he's a member of either the SAM or IBM, he can compete at that, the convention. So, there you go. Uh, to our friend that was just asking about that, if you are a member of the SAM or IBM, you can compete at that at the convention, at the convention that we were just talking about that's going on uh, this summer in Texas, which is pretty cool. All right. Thank you, Mr. Mike. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Get that goal. We are working on it, Richard Zach. Uh, we are 86% to the goal. Again, if we hit the goal, we're doing a big giveaway for one of you. And for everybody, we're going to do a five-minute flash sale. More details if we hit it. So stay tuned to find out if we're going to do our flash sale. It is looking pretty good tonight, so stay tuned. I want to keep you on your toes about the things that we're doing. So I'm very excited to very continue long. to add no, more I've been stuff good. I've been as the year goes right. on. No, no, uh, no, we have no, a couple no, of magicians no, right now over the on the TikTok. We, we, let's tune we in real quick. This, the and let's game, see right? what they well, are up the to. Looks like James Samuel is on. Uh, he just joined. The only magician's on at the moment. It is. So let me take a peek. And he is on with a guy named Shard, P.A.S. Please, please Magic. don't ever take it to and the point where it's, it's, it's um, dangerous thing. or it's uncomfortable. Um, this is a free magic show. You can just double tap the screen. But Pete, I'm going to leave you for 30 seconds. Okay. All right. Easy with the heart. All right, chat. We're battling magician versus magician. James seemed to be going crazy. I do not expect our team to snipe when they go crazy like that. So chat. Let's work together, see if we can get doubles. He did leave. We are winning, so we do get to talk. We need one rose, four different It's interesting people. because... Anyone who drops a rose will get a shout I'm, out. I'm this so new to this. Battle. What are your Nader, feelings you, on Kathy, performing on here? Now, obviously, right. he's doing Two this more roses, chat. Anyone drops So there's a, a bit of an interactive element to it. Double points. But when it comes to filming this magic might be the only way we could win. He's won two in a row. They've been going crazy. How does that feel? Do you make yourself do it? Because there's no connection. And for me, as a magician... I know I'm old so school. You're, thank you. One more Part of what I love about room. Magic is the they connection with the audience right and the right people I'm this. talking to. And it's going to be close. There's really a, no way to really do that we get when you are it. Okay. doing it all just right, to a camera. A lead, Forget the live doubles, element. They're probably gonna snipe. Um, but this is the all very interesting to me. I'd love to hear your thoughts on it. Everybody gets a shout out. You guys have been awesome. Three minutes left. If his team snipes again, i got to hold up that sign. But let's see what happens. I All can't right, talk. Two I'm losing. fifty-five seconds. Every gift to the shadow of galaxy instant fall back. <laughs> We've been showing a lot of cool tricks on here. So, so uh, thank you. That is something that I right. wanted to share. We've been showing a lot of cool tricks, but I have a feeling this team's going to snipe again on the, doubles. Uh, Let's show a little TikTok action. We'll come back to it. All right. Uh, I was going to ask. Easy with a confetti. Uh, why? What well, do I need to? How many confettis was that? Uh, okay, done with those dorks. Well, oh, they're not exposing oh, magic, so it's not a, it's not like they're doing anything wrong. Six you know, they're just doing what they're doing. Easy, yeah, easy. So thank you. We thank will you, continue on. Easy. I want to try a trick with you. Actually, go on. Right. I want to try a trick with you. So uh, a little um, bit more magic news for you, but you know, what? let's do a damn screen. giveaway. Let's go ahead and do a game. giveaway. It's one of our star supporters. I haven't added nearly enough to find the card. Now we're ninety-seven percent to the goal, which is freaking sick. I can't even though they can see great. Oh my days, Barry! Thank you so much. For subscribing, it means an awful lot. Um, I know I say it means an awful lot. Oh, very I'm lot, all out of whack. Does. This is a, a, a <laughs> oh man, your boy's all out of whack so here. What so is much. going on there? Yeah. There we go. Pete, it is not yes. Thirsty Thursday. It was before. Yes. So now, Pete, you're going to select a card by saying the word uh, stop whenever you like. Let's see. Shut up. 
just here. Can you remember right, this one for let me? Let me go back. Got here. it. Okay. There we go. I think I still had the audio going. My bad. So let me close that down. All right. Um, yeah. Thank you. I know. Can I? I know. I goofed up on that. My bad. See, I'm still new to the TikTok world. I'm still new. <laughs> My bad, friends. All right. So I have some names to add to our our list here. So um, hang tight for a minute while I add some names, just like the lovely Josh Huff. Thank you, Josh, for your support. Let me add you here. I have a few more people geared up back here behind the scenes, like Mr. Brian Cornwall. Doug James Scott R. Smith, back in rare form after the Gateway Close-Up Convention. Jim Cox, thank you for your support as well, sir. Jason R. Smith coming in hot with some love as well. Thank you very much, my friend. Glenn Henry, thank you, Glenn, for your support. Uh, think of this, friends, if you're new to the show, think of this as like a raffle. You know, you enter the raffle and maybe, just maybe, you will win the big prize from the raffle. Uh, the minimum uh, donation is a $2 donation. So, Mr. Cram, thank you for donating to tonight's show. Some people will donate more, which is cool, and some people will donate what they can, which is also appreciated. So, thank you to all of our friends uh, for us, uh, for helping us, I should say, get to our goals uh, pretty much every week around here. Uh, John Fitz, good to see you out there, Mr. Fitz. Kaboom. Kaboom. Hope the hand is healing well. Our buddy Fitz had a mishap here over the last couple months, and he's healing from the mishap. Um, Scott says he's still recovering from the St. Louis Convention. I'm so tired. Well, thanks for being here tonight, my friend. I uh, can't find the option anymore. Sorry, Eric. I'm not sure what's going on over there with the stars. Uh, I do apologize with that. All right. So let me take a look here. Uh, let's see, my stars work this week, thankfully. All right, well, thank you, Jake Wilbur, and thank you, Kevin Lawrence Sill. Kevin here. Uh, Kevin Lawrence Sill and Jake Wilbur. Thank you, Jake. Appreciate the love, my friend. And yes, I know, no super chat. I do apologize. We are working on that for sure. Uh, so sorry for the uh, inconvenience of that. I also have Mr. Mark Buffett out there. I'm doing Mark. Thanks for being here, one of our regulars around here on a Tuesday night. So thank you for being here. I don't know why that keeps trying to scoot out. Mark Buffett, got you covered, buddy. Uh, got to get Mr. Dwayne Winstead. Thank you, Dwayne, for the love out there as well. Dwayne Winstead, got you covered, buddy. And Richard Zack, the Zack Attack. Thank you, Mr. Zack. And Yort Spay, it's always a pleasure, Yort. Thank you, my friend. And Sammy Hoxa, Sammy, Sammy, Sammy. And Mr. Michael Dockin, one of our buddies that was there at the Gateway Convention as well. All right. So I think we are pretty much geared up here with the people that have donated to the show. So thank you for that, my friends. Appreciate it very much. Let's see who are first. Oops, looks like Orlando scooted in. Got to get Orlando. Thank you, Orlando, for your support tonight. All righty. Again, this isn't for the big giveaway. This is for um, one of our smaller giveaways before we get to that a little bit later. So let's do it to it, friends. Here we go. Let's see. Let's see. It's going to be Fitz. It is going to be Mr. Fitz. Congratulations to my buddy on being one of our first winners tonight. Congratulations. All right. Now, Mr. Fitz, you have a decision to make. Uh, if you're here for the first time, Fitz has won a prize valued around 25 30 bucks. It varies because we have a whole pile of stuff to send people. However, he can keep the prize and play it safe, or he can do what we like to call, uh, very simply put, uh, press your luck. He can press his luck if he wants to. I'm just going to pop up right there. So Fitz can, again, keep the prize. But if he decides to press his luck, we have these whammies that you see on the board, just like the real TV show, Press Your Luck. And our next wheel has whammies and the same number of prizes. So the thing is, he could win, and he could actually win twice, or he could win nothing. So you can go big, or you can go with your prize. Uh, Jake Rover says, you gotta press your luck. Ryan Wallace says, you gotta press it. Uh, you gotta press it. Come on, Scott R. Smith, you're in a good mood. You're supposed to be having a good time with us tonight, right? Uh, Ken Dunn says, you gotta press it. Yep, press it, of course. But I can't speak for Fitz. Let's see what Mr. Fitz is gonna say here. In just a moment, Glenn Henry says, we got to let it ride. Got to let it ride. So you guys, we're doing our best to convince him. Uh, but what does he want to do? He says, boom. 
that that doesn't oh okay uh roll the dice press the luck no whammy so you heard the man we are gonna press his luck let's do this all right everybody as i mentioned to you uh there are the same number of whammies as there are the same number of prizes it's 15 and 15 and we are going to mix this up we have prizes worth all the way up to $100 plus. And we have the big spin bonus, which is right there, where he gets to keep his original prize. And we have a second wheel with just prizes, no whammies. And that makes him the, pretty much having a chance to win double, double the stuff, which is cool. All right, so let's see what's gonna happen. We'll mix it up for you one more time. And let's see how we're gonna do for our friend Fitz. And keep in mind, some of the prizes are also yellow. I know some people were saying that's a lot of yellow. You can see though, the whammies are that. There's a prize, there's a prize. So there is, the prizes are also, some of them are yellow. So it is the same number. Uh, Jake Rober says, take a shot every time Luke says friends. All right, cheers, let's go. <laughs> Good luck. Don't forget it, if you're watching on Facebook, type exclamation point notify and you'll be notified every time we go live, which is pretty sweet. Very, very easy. Uh, yes, yes, you got it, Scott. It is the limoncello color of yellow. <laughs> so here we go. We are sliding on in. There is a big spin bonus, which is cool. So let's see here. Big spin bonus is a good one. That means Fitz gets to keep his prize that he already won and we are now going to scoot over to the bonus prize wheel. I'm going to reboot this one. And this one, again, only has prizes on it. So he's going to win two prizes tonight for the price of one. So we're going to mix these up a little bit. Let's see what happens. We are going to hook him up with two prizes, not just one. All right. Yep. See, David first knows. Told you to press it. Exactly. <laughs> Here we go. His next prize is going to be the Secret Gap Carry. These are badass. These sell for 75 bucks. And you're going to get a little bonus trick thrown in with it. You won three things tonight, Fitz. You got your first prize, which will be a surprise. You won the Secret Gap Carry, which is a very nice leather holder that pops up for all your packet tricks. And we'll actually throw in a trick for you, too. Those are valued at 75 You won over $100 of stuff just for being part of our star supporters tonight. So thank you, Mr. Fitz. Congratulations. All right. And of course, we need you to do one quick thing for us. Drop us an email, info at allthingsmagic.com to claim your prize, Mr. Fitz. Yeah, one week to claim your prize. So be sure to do it to it. And yes, boom is the word of the night for Mr. Fitz. So yeah, congrats, my friend. Good stuff. Congratulations. All right. We will leave this, and who knows, we may be visiting both of these wheels again very soon. And don't forget, if you are just getting here, we have our free wheel that will be spinning at least one more time. If you would like to be added to the wheel here, all you need to do is say the word win in the comments, and that will get you added to our free giveaways tonight as well. So if you're just getting here, don't worry, you still have time to win. So be sure to enter, and that way, you will have your chance to win. I did see uh, Ron Jackson out there, Action Jackson. So I'm going to add him real quick to our giveaways this evening. All right. Let's take a look at our goal tonight. We're over 100% of the goal. So, my friends, this is going to happen. We are going to do a big giveaway, and we're going to do a flash sale. Do you guys, you can decide which one do you want us to do first. Do you want us to go ahead and jump in? It's a five-minute flash sale. I'll tell you how much the discount is for. However... We also are doing a big giveaway as well. So you need to help me decide which one we should do. And yes, we did meet our goal tonight. So thank you. Wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Uh, I think I got a couple of people I need to add to the wheel as well. The uh, prize wheel here. Uh, I need to add, uh, who do I need to add there? Timothy Ambrose. I need to add Timothy. Let me add him real quick to our star supporters. Thank you, Timothy, for your support. And I also need to add uh, Lawrence Bandani. I think I added, I don't think I added Lawrence out there. Good to see you out there, Lawrence. Thank you for your support. 
Uh, the giveaway first, flash sale first. Do the flash. No, we're doing it tonight. Uh, flash sale first. All right. So here's what we're going to do, friends. Uh, we are going to gear up the All Things Magic shop, which if you didn't know, All Things Magic, uh, we have a full-blown magic shop, but we only offer hand-picked magic tricks. We're a very boutique type of place. And we are going to set this up for you. A 15% off code doesn't even need to happen. It will automatically show up, and we'll do this in just a second. One sec. 15% off your order tonight. And we will do this for the next five minutes. So let's get this going over here. I've got this handled on the back end, so I'll take care of it. Automatic discount, 15% off, uh, $1 minimum purchase, and it also includes your shipping discount. That is now, uh, let me go back, the title can't be, play. oh, okay, uh, Taco uh, Stars. All right, so we'll do that. And there we go. So my friends, for the next five minutes, if you are already on the All Things Magic shop, and if you would like to go and have a look around for the next little bit, we'll put the link in the chat for you. Refresh your browser right now. Uh, for the next five minutes and five minutes alone, we'll actually bring up the countdown for you here you have a chance to save 15% on your order with us here at All Things Magic. So the link is in the chat for you. Don't forget, we have brand new stuff that just dropped tonight. You could use that 50% discount for the Ultimate Vanishing Bottle or any of our other hand-picked tricks tonight or any of the other things that you might have had your eye on tonight. So four and a half minutes to go on that. Let me take a quick bite of the tacos. See, it pays to watch live, friends. If you are someone that's watching later, this should hopefully entice you to watch the next time we go live. 8.30 Eastern Time, every single Tuesday night, we do all these giveaways. Now we're doing surprises where we pop up with these flash sales for you. But you have to be here in order to get any of this free stuff or the discounts, right? So there we go. Thank you, Mr. Jake, for the uh, support. We appreciate it very, very much. Thank you very, very much for that. So four minutes and counting for your orders out there, friends. Be sure to get in there and save 15% on your orders with us tonight at the All Things Magic Shop. The time will run out before the tacos are gone. This is true. I'm slow rolling the tacos tonight. <laughs> I'm totally slow rolling tacos. I am. This is true. What did I? What else did I miss? I see another message here on my side. Uh, okay, so the TikTok audio was still coming through. Got it. Okay, so I'm actually going to mute this real quick. Uh, we'll just mute that all the way through. Okay, cool. Um, I'm going to take this down for just one sec. The countdown is going to keep going. I want to take a quick peek over on the TikTok to see if there's any more magic we can take a peek at while we're waiting for the countdown to continue. It's three minutes left to go, friends. Three minutes and counting for our flash sale that's going on right now, tonight only. Tonight only, live during our show. Head over to allthingsmagic.com. You can grab a shirt. You could grab some merch. You could grab some magic tricks you've had your eye on. We also have some really cool, little more expensive stuff that you might want to take a peek at. Uh, what are those things you might ask? Well, maybe a couple of things that might entice you tonight. Uh, something like this guy. This is brand new Constructo. You're able to have a thought of card materialize in your hand and then show that it is the card. Uh, this is also nice, the new IRful watch teamed up with Blues or Magic. Our friend Joe Berman knows what this is about. There are multiple watches to choose from, a little more expensive. Save 15% on that for the next two minutes and 15 seconds. That's another thing you can save on during our quick flash. So here, don't miss out on that. Uh, the TikTok audio is coming through again. Let me mute it. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Uh, so we have that. Uh, what else do we have that's uh, really... Oh, yes, the ring on shoelace. The ring on shoelace. Now it's your chance to also... Uh, the thing that fooled Penn and Teller. You can also get your hands on that. For the next two minutes, this is 15% off as well. So uh, take advantage of this quick flash sale, and it's all thanks to you, my friends, for helping us hit our goal tonight. And we're still doing a big giveaway on top of it. A minute and 30 seconds left to go. I did mute the uh, background for TikTok now. So thank you again for the heads up. 
learning as we go, right? Learning as we go. Uh, let's see. Uh, here's 200 stars for David Parr. Put him on the wheel. I will. Thank you for that, Scott R. Smith. Um, I will add him over here behind the scenes. Thank you for that. Uh, you are all set, Mr. David Parr, courtesy of our friend, Scott R. Smith. All right. Thank you for that. Uh, he's fired from TikTok and needs to leave it up to me and our kiddo. <laughs> I'm, I'm fired. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, F-bomb crap. Entourage is sold out. Sorry. Uh, Jake told me how cool it is. and have this. Yeah, so we'll, we'll get more. But yeah. Um, hey, we didn't all get together in Vegas a couple weeks ago, brother, but we'll make it up. We'll make it for it live. Oh, good. You're coming. All right. Well, cool. That'll work. Looking forward to seeing you, my friend. Uh, Jay Carlo, good to see you. Thank you for joining our free giveaways. We'll get you added up there. Uh, we'll do that right now. Jay Carlo. Let me add you. Jay Carlo. I'll just put you in as that. Brian Garber, thank you for the love out there as well. 24 seconds left to go, friends. The flash sale is still yours for the next 20 seconds. 15% off your order. Get in now while you can. Um, and if we end up hitting... Uh, if we end up hitting like another mini goal, maybe we'll even drop in another flash sale. I don't know, but we'll, I haven't thought that far. So here we go. Three, two, one. And we are officially at the end of our flash sale. So thank you, friends. That will now be deactivated as the phone falls to the floor crashing. Uh, so we'll go ahead and deactivate that right now. So that is now officially gone. No more flash sale. All right. <laughs> All right, friends. So that is fun. I did see David Parr was here. Uh, and thank you, Rick Johnson, for joining in on our free giveaway tonight. Uh, one of the things that I wanted to show you tonight was actually David Parr on TV. He visited one of the local news channels that was uh, in the same city as the Gateway Close-Up Convention. And David popped up and talked about the convention, but also performed a little bit of magic. I've got that keyed up for you right now. So I'm going to take a little break for a couple minutes. If you're just getting here, be sure to say when. We'll spin the free wheel coming up. And don't forget, if you haven't yet, you can donate stars. You're still in the running for our big giveaway that we're doing here coming up in a few minutes as well. So stay tuned, friends. But right now, let's enjoy some magic from David Paul. Special guest in studio this morning who traveled to Collinsville, Illinois this weekend for a magic convention. David Parr is an internationally acclaimed magician known for his captivating performances and storytelling. You might even recognize him from his appearance on the hit TV show Penn and Teller's Fool Us. In front of a live audience and millions of viewers, David put his magic to the ultimate test, leaving legendary magicians Penn and Teller absolutely stumped. You fooled them. Not many people can do that, David. Indeed. Indeed. I, I was even surprised. You can see the look of surprise on my face. Absolutely, yeah. you could. Definitely look that segment up on YouTube. But we wanted to see if he could fool us, too. I don't think it'll be too hard, David. No pressure. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Thanks for joining us, too. Thank you, Laura. Now, this okay. was one of the key pieces of evidence in the Salem witch trials. Mm. They called it a poppet, which is an old-timey word for a simple handmade doll like this. Okay. Now there are perfectly innocent reasons why this might have been found in someone's house, but they insisted this was used for witchcraft, okay. specifically for placing a curse on someone. And I'll show you how this works. First, I have to picture someone I don't like. So give me a moment. <laughs> oh, I got me. someone. My seventh grade algebra teacher. Okay. Yeah. And then picturing that person, I make a clockwise circle like this. Actually. Um, would you make a clockwise circle over the doll? Just point downward like this. Like this. Up a little more and make a clockwise circle. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay. You'll oh, my start gosh. You'll see the magic taking effect Ooh. in just a second here. <laughs> now, here, hold on to this. Uh. Check, check this out. <laughs> Can I have the glass? Of course. There, now the curse is trapped. It can't harm anyone. Oh, good. You can get a nice close look at it. Oh my gosh. It's kind of creepy, right? Very creepy. Because you can see it moving in there. <laughs> now, at this point, we can do one of two things. Okay. We can lift the glass, release the curse to do its work, or mm. we can reverse it. We can deactivate the curse. I'll, I'll leave that up to you. Let's deactivate the curse. Yeah, reverse it? It's a Sunday morning. Okay, yeah. <laughs> then we have to make a, a counterclockwise circle. Here, hold on to this, okay. if you would, please counterclockwise like this oh my gosh. to deactivate. 
clockwise to activate like this. I see. Go ahead, try a counterclockwise circle. Check that out. Oh my goodness. There, look at that. It's the like spell I had is the magic broken. Touch too. It's just a normal <laughs> creepy doll now. Oh my gosh. That was fascinating. David, thank, thank you. you. I'm fooled. Okay, good. Jamie, are you fooled? She, she's, she's like, what just happened? Uh, yay. <laughs> Thank you, David, so awesome. much. Well, it's how was the convention, here. by the way? It was fun. You know, we, we have these conferences where mm -hmm. magicians get together, exchange ideas. There are lectures and workshops, and I presented a lecture. It was really fun. That's amazing. And you're, you have ties to the Chicago area. Tell us a little bit about what you're up to now. Um, I'm about to do a residency. There's a multi-million dollar theater in Chicago just completely devoted to magic. It's called the Chicago Magic Lounge. And from July through September, I'm going to be the artist in residence there. So I'll be doing my show there every Wednesday night. Oh my gosh. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to talk with us. And if you guys are ever in the Chicago area, be sure to look up his show and we'll post more info about David on our website, fox2now.com. We'll be right back. And we are right back. And a uh, shout out to David Porter. That was freaking great, man. Good stuff. Good, good stuff. Uh, and I heard that the convention was a great time. I really wish I could have seen David and the rest of our friends that were at the Gateway Convention. Um, but as you know, sometimes, you know, other things pop up and as they always say there's always next time, all right? Uh, businessman Luke, please, I wanna know about the Merlin Award. Truthfully, that's something that um, is, there's a, lot of, there's a lot of stuff about it that people wanna, you know, speak rumors to. Uh, I know a lot of people say that the Merlin Award, while it might seem grand, is actually something you can just pay for. Uh, and I'll kind of leave it there. So I don't know, I don't have a Merlin Award, but I do know that there's a lot of um, kind of controversy around it. So good luck with that. But I know people love to add it to the shelf of uh, their other accolades as well. So, yeah. And yes, great job to David on his performance there. Miss Amber Wyatt has also arrived. Good to see you out there, Amber. Hope all is well with you and the Wyatt fam. All right, so I got you added up over there too. Okie dokie. Cool. So uh, the next thing that we wanted to tell you about before we do our next free giveaway, which is going to be coming up here in just a second, is one of our own, Mr. Mike Hankins. He has been sitting on an idea, this concept in his head for quite a while. It is a um, very interesting method here that I think you'll really enjoy from the mind of Mike Hankins. The quote is actually here from Nicholas Lawrence, who had some really nice things to say about it. The quote from Nicholas Lawrence is, the perfect everyday coin and bottle. The method is actually, the method actually shocked me. So this is something that even though uh, Nicholas thought a lot about magic, sometimes methods even will shock some of the most creative people out there as well. So let's take a look together, a little peek ski behind the scenes of what this is from Mr. Mike Hankins. Enjoy. What's up everybody, Mike Hankins here to talk to you today about the Notorious CIB. What the heck is the Notorious CIB? It's simple. It is a 100% gimmickless coin and bottle routine. No gimmicks, no cuts in the bottle, nothing of that sort. You can even borrow the bottle. You see someone drinking a bottle, say, hey, uh, spectator, give me, give me that bottle. And they'll say, okay, magician. And then you proceed to do the effect. And I guarantee within five minutes of watching this video, grabbing a bottle and a coin, you'll be performing the Notorious CIB in no time. So without further ado, is it further ado, further? Let's get into it. Today, order today. <laughs> so there you go. Mr. Mike Angans, this is a digital download. So the cool part about it is you can start learning how to do this tonight, after the show. Wait until after the show, though. Uh, you can purchase it now, later on tonight. You could 
you know, kick your feet up, download this and watch it. And you will learn a very clever method from my thinking. So uh, that's why it is 13 bucks. Is it is a digital download that you'll be learning how to do that trick. So that is that. All right. So uh, check it out. Uh, Scott R. Smith says, uh, Mike Hankins rocks. and loves magic. I want to buy videos of him doing card magic. Maybe Mike will have more to, to offer here in the near future. We will have to wait with bated breath to find out. <laughs> so there we go. New stuff from Mike Hankins. All right, all right. <laughs> Let's do another free giveaway now. Since we're in this fun time here, the fun, the goodness continues with the All Things Magic fam. So let's have a little more fun with some free giveaways uh, right about now. Let's do it, friends. All right, here we are. If you are just getting here, well, there's always next time. So we've got a whole list of people here, uh, over 70 people on the prize wheel. And we do have those whammies on here too. If we do land on a whammy, because some friends are new, if it lands on one of these guys, that means there's no winner for that spin pretty much erases that chance for you to win. So we do not, we do not, we do not want to see them pop up. We do not, but they are there. So get out of here for now. Get out of here. There, okay, get out, okay. So let us see who our next free winner is gonna be. Let me mix this up just a tad, and here we go. Taco Tuesday with tacos, and I'm making a mess over here. <laughs> mm. Congratulations going out to Mr. Justin Teeman, the Teeman man. Justin's going to grab a $10 gift card to the All Things Magic Shop. $10 to spend however he wants. He could even almost buy the Notorious CIB download that you just saw, the coin and bottle. You could almost buy that. Almost there. Or anything else that we have. That is his to enjoy. Info at allthingsmagic.com. That is where you can reach us to claim your prize, Mr. Justin. And it is one more reminder to our friends that are winners around here. Number one, you have a week to claim your prize. Number two, uh, when you do email us about your prize, give us a day or two. Give our team a day or two to get back to you. They always do. So just give us that 24 to 48 hours to get back to you. But we always receive your emails. So don't worry about us. Uh, we got you covered. Okay. So anyway, one more time. Congratulations. Congratulations. Well, Mr. Justin. All righty. And we'll reboot the wheel. We do have our big giveaway coming up here uh, in just a couple more minutes. So stay tuned to find out who our big winner of the night is. Over $200 of magic going to one of you, one of our star supporters, I should say. So that is something that you will have to wait just a little bit longer to find out who that is going to be. Uh, one other thing that I had here keyed up was this. This was shared in the All Things Magic group from Tyler Fergus. Thank you, Tyler, for sharing this. This one is when magic goes wrong. Now, I'm not taking joy in this, but the question that goes along with it is, what's the one thing that went wrong in your show and how did you recover? Unfortunately, from this one, I don't think there's any way to recover from the broom suspension not suspending. I do believe that is something that just doesn't, there's just no going back from that one. So if you guys have ever had something like this go wrong, Maybe it was an illusion like this. Maybe it was just something, you know, where you maybe you did the, the smash and stab and you actually stabbed instead of smashed. I don't know. Uh, but the question is, again, we're not taking joy in this. But as Tyler says, what's the one thing that went wrong in your show? How did you recover? Because let's be honest, shit always goes wrong. Shit always can go wrong. As magicians, we do our best to make sure that things don't go wrong, but they can and they do go wrong. Uh, so if you've ever had something like that go wrong, let us know. Again, it's just so that we can all kind of relate to the not so good times that do happen as a magician. So there we go. All right. Um, I have had everything go wrong. That is why I'm a hobbyist. <laughs> all right, Scott. Thank you, Hank Morphin, for the support. We will get you added up to our free giveaways here. Right about now, uh, Mr. Hank, let me do that right now. Thank you for the support. And you are added, my friend, to our big giveaway, so stay tuned. So anyway, uh, that is that. A little something that I wanted to show you 
over in the All Things Magic group. Speaking of that, let's take a little peek to see if there's anything else going on. Again, this is our private group just for magicians. Sometimes we share a little more information um, for each other because it is a private group and every person that is in the group has been screened so that we know that you are actually a magician. So if you would like to apply, we would welcome you to. We do have moderators now helping us get through those entries, but we have uh, at least 2,000 people trying to get in right now. So help us uh, just by being a little more patient with that. Tom Molica never gets old watching him. If you've never seen him, you know, YouTube. Go to YouTube and watch him. You, you will love him. Uh, Xavier Mortimer doing Escapes and Deserts in a porta potty. There's that. Uh, <laughs> uh, we got Scott R. Smith, who's home alone tonight. I'm watching Taco Tuesday. That's dangerous. I also wanted to take a quick moment to welcome some of the new friends. Uh, yesterday, we did our welcome message to a lot of our new members. Wanted to kind of gloss over some of the names here quickly. Uh, we've got friends like Arlen uh, Solomon, who's actually one of the SAM guys. He helps out the young, excuse me, the young magicians, which is very cool. Wanted to give him a shout out for that. Uh, we also have friends like Benjamin Slade. We've got Carl Michael out there from Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. Steve Shufton, the legendary Steve Shufton, who's out there. Steve's done a lot of great work over the years. Ivan Amodi, he's a guy from LA that does really high end, like, uh, shows and private events for like celebrities and stuff so he's i think he's known as like the millionaire magician ivan emoti good to have him here too a lot of other people here as well bruce gold another la guy good to have him here scott tokar who is actually a amazing uh, trade show magician uh nice to have him with us uh miss janet robinson who is the wife of scott robinson who you might have his book but know his work scott robinson is my old pal from North Carolina, the Charlotte area. We we kind of were the originators of the Slight Club that now exists. I was one of the uh, the OG members of that, which is pretty cool. Uh, is there a magician you'd still like to meet? Well, 90 Day, unfortunately, I'll never have a chance to meet the late, great Larry Jennings. That was my guy growing up. I love Larry Jennings' work. Uh, but these days, is there a magician that you'd still like to meet? I'm sure that there's... I'll have to brew on that a little bit. Um, but Jennings is the one that I always wish I had a chance to meet uh, before he passed. So, yeah. Uh, let's see. Any other stuff going on here? I love it when the friends in the group post questions for each other. They really offer help. Like John Shack, where do you perform? You know, there's always new and creative places to perform, too. So it was nice to see people getting in here and answering those questions. Ron Jackson, our moderator. Uh, have you ever been in a scenario when you're booked to perform magic, but the situation isn't right at th for it at that time? Uh, I believe he was talking about here where someone um, proposed to someone, and then it's like, okay, here's the magician. But all the people are going up to congratulate him, so that was his thing. Uh, yeah. Uh, Dan Sperry in the house. Good to see Mr. Dan Sperry. What the hell? Uh, Ivan had a dope pool theme. Oh my God. No uh, close up back to remember right back in the day. Oh, like billiard balls. Okay, that's cool. Billiard pool. Oh, billiard pool. Okay, gotcha. Dan Sperry, good to have you in the house, my friend. Hope you are safe out there on the road. Um, any advice on of opening a channel about street magic like Dynamo, Yif, Cyril? Uh, just do it. I think the biggest thing is if you want to do something, just do it. Start. Take the first step. As so many creators have said, you know, they were awful in the beginning, but you only can get better. So you got to start to get better um, with anything. So I think just do it, businessman. Just don't be out there exposing magic. We'll have to give you a little psh, psh for that. Uh, Luke wants to meet those on here that haven't had the pleasure to do a Magic Live. I'm sure. Well, Ryan, are you coming? Are you coming to Magic Live? Love to see you. That'd be cool, man. Um, and there will be some Magic Live news for you coming up shortly. I was talking to my friends, Jake Rober and Jason R. Smith, about it yesterday. We're getting closer to trying to lock in something for you guys. So stay tuned for that, okay? All right, so that's just a few of the things I want to share with you in the All Things Magic group as well. You're all welcome there as long as you are a magician and you're not out there exposing and doing the wrong things. That's not what we stand for. We are all about respecting the art, the art of magic. That's what we're all about around here. Okay. So uh, we have a big giveaway to do, and before we do that, I want to share with you one more piece of magic. This is a full uncut performance of something that I really fell in love with. I watched this. It's kind of flown under the radar. Wanted to drop this one in. This was kind of like our bonus top three this week. This one is very cool and a little different, and it's not expensive either. It's called the Knotted Necklace, 
and there's a lot to like about it. And I'll tell you more about it on the other side of the video. Here is a full uncut performance though for you to enjoy right now. There you go, my friends. That is the knotted necklace, a very cool, very different piece of magic that I thought that you would enjoy. We do have that for you in the All Things Magic shop. Of course, the link is in the chat. Uh, Ryan's like, what the who? Yeah, it's fun, man. It's different, which is why I like it. So have a look at that one. I do like the fact that you're able to literally take the knots off of the um, necklace there and then toss them back on. So that's the knotted necklace right there for you. All right, cool. So uh you love it right yeah I, you know we do our best to only bring you the good stuff uh kind of looks like bakos but with the chain a bit different yes 100 percent, absolutely uh very cool indeed mr cram indeed uh beautiful yes it is beautiful <laughs> uh okay so i have um those are all those are all the tricks those are all the tricks there was one thing i wanted to tell you real quick before we do our big giveaway and that is this. This is actually back in stock. We have two uh, that we're able to sell because these are, uh, I think like there were 10 available. We grabbed a few and we are already down to just two ourselves. So I don't know when these will be back again, but stage by stage, we're going to have John Graham on as a coming, uh, one of our guests coming up soon. Stage by stage is one of the best books we've recommended probably this year. Someone was asking earlier, Luke, what are your top picks this year? Don't know if stage by stage was released this year, but it is one of the best releases we've had this year for you. And it literally talks about taking your magic from close up and going to stage or have it played bigger. And there are also some really, really strong magic effects taught in there in their entirety with the, the presentation and the script and everything. Um, this one is fantastic. And we do have uh, just a couple of these left. Um, couldn't wait to get them back in stock. So if you've been waiting on this, Stage by Stage is back. So I want to say that. And yes, John Graham will be our guest. Yes, he will. He actually was very... Um, he actually agreed and said, yes, I'll do it. So very, very kind of him to do that. Uh, were you a consultant for some big names in magic? Yes, I was, businessman. Uh, consulted for Chris Angel for almost 10 years, like seven and some change, almost eight. And we had a blast together. So I was with Chris Angel for quite a while. Does some other consulting along the way. And I'll, I'm actually doing some consulting again now for some television projects and some live shows and stuff that I can't really talk about. Um, but yes, I've done a lot of consulting and I'm currently doing some as well. But as you know, in this business, when you're doing stuff, sometimes you can't really talk about what you're doing. But yes, uh, Luke is consulting all these years later. So yeah, good question. Uh, the book is from 2021. Okay, I just found out about it this year then. There you go. <laughs> all right. Uh, thank you, businessman. Appreciate the love out there. Yeah, I just love magic, man. I just really, really love this stuff. So. Uh, Scott R. Smith, Luke Rocks. He is a great contributor to the world of magic. Well, thank you, Scott. That means a lot. I really just have such a passion for this stuff, and it's fun to be able to kind of do it for a living now. So, yeah, thank you for allowing me to do that, friends. All right, so with that said, it is now time. It is the time to do our big 
dollar magic giveaway extravaganza. Let's, let's do the damn thing. You guys ready? <laughs> Joe Monty says loop through Chris Angel out of a window. I did not. I absolutely did not. <laughs> That's hilarious. Uh, th this means you're way better than Luke, Chris, than Luke, Chris. Chris is the man. He's great. <laughs> I didn't throw Chris Angel out the window. That's hilarious. Oh, my God. Where's the... There it is. <laughs> no, I did not. I absolutely did not. <laughs> you stop this, Tyrone. <laughs> you stop this slanderer. <laughs> oh, too funny. All right, friends. Well, I want to say thank you to each and every person that was part of our star supporters tonight. I know YouTube, we can't do the monetization at the moment. So sorry for YouTube friends, but Facebook, thank you for helping us hit our goal. Uh, we did our flash sale tonight. I hope you were able to take advantage of that. That's not something we're going to do every time, but we're going to do it from time to time just to keep you on your toes. So thank you for participating in that. Uh, it is now time to do a quick little thank you to our friends uh, that did donate, because I like to give a shout out to friends too um, that have actually supported what we do. People like Derek Bumpus, Josh Huff, Brian Cornwall, Mr. Doug James, Scott R. Smith, Mr. Jim Cox, Jason R. Smith, not to be confused with Scott R. Smith, uh, Glenn Henry, Mr. Cram, Mr. Chris Cram, Mr. Fitz, kaboom, he was our winner earlier. Uh, we have Joe Berman out there, Kevin Lawrence Sell, Lawrence Bandani, Jake Rober, Mr. Mark Buffett, got Dwayne Winstead, Orlando Rodriguez, Timothy Ambrose, Doug Heitzman, Hank Morphin, David Parr, Richard Zack, Ewart Spades, Sammy Hoxha, and the best for last. We've got Mr. Michael Dawkins. You're all the best, but you know, Michael Dawkins, right down here. <laughs> uh, much love, Mr. Doug James. The love goes right over to you. Doug James, my very first magic mentor uh, back in the day. So always a pleasure to see Mr. Doug out there watching our shows. All right. And I think I actually have, I'm actually doubled up on the chat. I just saw that. <laughs> That's funny. So friends, it is time to see who that big winner is going to be. Let's do it to it. Good luck, everybody. Good luck. Here we go. Good luck to our big winner of the night. Coming your way right now. Let us see. And a big congratulations going out to the winner and only Mr. Yort Spades. We got to give him some love. Congratulations. Yort Spades, you need to email us, Mr. Yort, in order to claim your prize. Info at allthingsmagic.com. That will get you hooked up with a $200 plus mystery bag of magic. We'll throw in some minimalism. Yes. We'll throw in some close-up magic. Yes. Some playing cards. Yes. And maybe some extra special stuff in there too. A nice little variety of magic just for you. Our big star supporters winner of the night, Mr. Yort Spade. So congrats again to Yort. And thank you again to all of you for the support. You helped us also hit our goal tonight to do a flash sale. So that's kind of a win-win for everybody at the end of the day. So there we go. All right. And as a reminder, once again, if you are watching on the Facebooks, I know it's old school, uh, type exclamation point notify to, to know when we are live. It'll actually notify you going forward that we are live here. And yes, we are live every single Tuesday, 8.30 Eastern time when I'm not busy or not sick. And I do want to say, last week I was pretty damn sick. So there was no show last week because of that. I had a lot of people asking. Um, I was down for the count. Whatever the hell it was, it got me good. Feeling much, much better. But last week is why there was no show. I was sick as a dog. So yes, don't forget to do that though, to know when we are live. It makes your life a whole lot easier. And we do send out emails when we go live, so there are ways to click the links there, too, so you can sign up for that over on the All Things Magic website. There is no spam. There's none of that BS. Uh, you can go down to the very bottom of the page right there. Subscribe to our newsletter. Uh, we only bring you magic, whether it's products or sales. Sales. Uh, never spam. We don't spam you. We don't even send that many emails. 
but it is all magic. Um, so be sure to sign up and that we also get notified when we are live here with you on Taco Tuesday. A uh, quick little recap for you on what went down tonight. I think we should do that. If you're just getting here, what the heck did we talk about when it comes to the products? Well, let me show you uh, right about now. Let's go, friends. Recap time. The first thing I told you about, we literally just got these in stock. The Ultimate Vanishing Bottles from Henry Harrius. This is now the Coke version of the bottle instead of the Corona version. These also include, these do include the sound gimmick to give that convincer that it really is a real bottle. That is something that you definitely don't want to miss. Not every shop's got these, but we do, and we are proud to have them for you. Speaking of the bottles, don't forget, we also told you about the Notorious CIB. It's a queen and bottle. The very clever method it's a download so you can start learning that tonight that was something else we told you about along with this guy right here the organic switch box from julio montoro the tic tac box has a card in it you do a card routine sign card come back to it you're going to see the switch here there's a spectator's card you're going to reach down and grab the tic tac tic tac i did it again the tic tac box tic tac box and you are then going to take the lid off the box and when you do now the card has been switched for their sign card this is fantastic, and it looks like an everyday object, and now you can do it too. We also told you about the knotted necklace. We just showed you that a few minutes ago, where you literally make knots in the necklace, and then you pull them off one by one, and you put them back on the necklace, and then you are left uh, with just a necklace they can examine at the end. Very clever, very different piece of magic. And then I also told you about this real quick, uh, but more importantly, uh, these are also back in stock, the Morgan coin sets. These replicas, I've got a, a set for myself. They look and sound the part. And yes, you also receive the turtle. These are beautiful for 60 bucks. Good luck finding a better set out there. I swear by these. These are fantastic. So that is also something that is back in stock. Want to let you know. Oh, so I got to do this. If it's back in stock, we got to do this way. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I got to do that. So there we go. A little back in stock action for you. All right. So that is with a little bit of recap. Of course, we also told you about the Gateway Close the Convention and the friends that were there. And we are looking forward to bringing you more stuff on next week's show. So let me go ahead and get out of here. Uh, we will be back next Tuesday. And that is that for this week's show. So there we go. Good night, everybody, and all things Magic Lounge. I'll pop in for a few after this. Much love to my friends for supporting what we do tonight. And the All Things Magic shop is open 24-7. So don't feel free. You know, don't just think you have to shop now. Feel free to visit us anytime. We'll take care of you, not just for your tricks, but also for Magic News. We have that on there, too, for you. So... Much love to my friends. I will catch you next week right here. Yes, they do, man. These, they do get better and better. I sure freaking do, man. All right. I will see you in the lounge, you limoncello drinking fool. <laughs> Jake Robert, thank you as well for being such a cool guy and just being part of what we do. Thank you, my friend. You're the man. Cheers. Cheers. Jake Robert. you guys next week thank you derek bumpus and the bumpus fam thank you for your support Derek. appreciate it very very much derek hopefully you're coming to magic live right right ellis cohen good to see you buddy thanks for being here good night to ryan garber giving the good night to the brothers and the sisters thank you ken dunn thank you sir appreciate you all right everybody that's that i will see you all next week right here bye bye oh i gotta get dug in gotta get dug in <laughs> and Mr. Cram, thank you, buddy. Good to see you. Help me forget the real world for a bit. That's what this is all about, Mr. Cram. That's what this is all about. Hope, you, hope you're doing okay. And thank you, Justin. Thank you. All right. That's what this is about, though, friends. Hopefully, whatever's going on in your life, we are here to take your mind off of things. And uh, as I always say, it's okay to not be okay as well. So uh, great night, two weeks in a row, and no whammies. Thanks, Luke. At a time. Yes, we are. Bye-bye. Thank you, and good night.